Hello, uh, this is uh, my Beast Zine. Uh, I finally got it. This is printed by Blurb. Uh, it's uh, paper quality wise, it's the economy uh, version. I didn't manage to get uh, uh, the better paper. It uh, wouldn't let me select it when I was doing the books. I need to look into why that was the case. But uh, on the whole, it's weird. Um, I'll keep going back to. Um, Two years ago, when I ordered a blurb magazine, and the colours were beautiful all the way through, uh, from front to back. Paper quality was kind of weird, and uh, it was very uh, flimsy. But the print quality was very nice. Now this is the second magazine I've got, and unless it's the pictures I'm using, um, the colours are just pretty nasty. Um, I would say now, if you're going to use blurb magazine and using the economy paper, which I'm sure is a, a reason why this is looking like uh, like shit. Uh, but the, the colours are very muted, there's very little shadows, um, uh, sorry, a very little black. Um, the, the shadows are very muddy, um, the colours are very strange, strange because red becomes orange, or beetroot, and blue, and uh, bright green are super strong, and you'll see that through the uh, through the magazine itself. Um, some pictures are sharper than others, which is odd because they were all converted to um, B300 DPI uh, or PPI, yeah, DPI. Sorry, yeah. Um, so it's odd. Some look really messy, and others look a little bit better. Um, it is an odd, odd, odd mix. Um, I don't know. I don't know if it's something I would put up for sale. I think it's okay, you know, I think um, the layout isn't too bad, um, and I like the pictures, um, it's just the print quality is very strange, so uh, um, yeah, it's a, it's a hard one really, I don't know if I would put it up for for sale, um, and there was <laughs> there was more pages, um, it seems to be a few pages short, because um, the final pay, the final uh, image of a dog's face was actually a double page spread and it went on to a couple more pictures before it ended so um, it was very weird because I initially wanted to make it 38 pages but it wouldn't let me do that so I brought it down to 34 and didn't like that either and then I made it 32 and I made all these uh, pages page cuts um, but even with the page cuts there was more pictures but it actually ends okay it ends in a way that is all right, so uh, I'm not too fussed about that. Um, it didn't end in a weird half uh, double page spread. I mean, it was a double page spread picture, but the half that it <laughs> they ended on is okay, and it makes it and it kind of works a wee bit. So not sure, uh, humming and hawing about whether to put this up for for sale to anybody to buy. I'm not entirely sure what the final cost is going to be if I do put this up for sale. Um, Zines are supposed to be fairly cheap, and if this is four or five pounds to, to buy and then add postage on top, is, is that really um, is that really a truly a zine? I don't know. Uh, but uh, I'll think about that for a while. Anyway, here's the here's the video of it with some cuts, just so you can see some of the print roller marks. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy. Thank you.